heard smoke from the Admiral. Uh, fire company responded and confirmed on her arrival they had a working fire. Crews began to advance lines uh, into the barge of uh, the Admiral and attack the fire. Uh, at this time, they brought the fire under control. We do have a two alarm, uh, a second alarm at this location. And where has the fire been, to your knowledge, concentrated? Uh, in the uh, top, uh, top of the barge, uh, the Admiral on the southern end of the barge. Yeah, what's, what's up there? Where did it start? I haven't been inside to see what has actually been burned. So, Captain, it's isolated to that stuff we see sticking up on the top, very top of the boat, right? That is correct. Nothing down below that? No. And there's a lot of pickup trucks in the parking lot. Some people came out and said there's an acetylene torch cutting operation going underway. Is that something you're looking into? Uh, every, the fire investigation unit will come out here and, and look into uh, what's going on out here. This, this How serious is the damage inside? I don't know at this time. I have not been onto the Admiral to look at it. But at this point in the universe of possibilities, uh, it doesn't look like arson, it doesn't look like a warming fire, and it looks like maybe there's people on board there doing some type of construction or cutting. Okay. It, it, and that would be premature for me to, to respond. Uh, it's going to be under investigation and we'll come up with a determination. Anybody injured? No injuries at this time. The work has been evacuated from the, uh, from the area and uh, firefighters are getting uh, fire under control. How many workers were evacuated? I don't know. There were people working on board. That is correct. There, there were people on the all the time. Kevin, you talked about uh, for your people working in these conditions, uh, cold weather, water freezing up. 